Yo dudes, the Empire's pretty chill. Maybe you could like join it or something. One, Luke and Mouse Prime here, so it's time for another food review today. And today, guys, I'm going to try another example of a shall I say, like a healthy snack today. So it's like kind of a bit like you know, crisp in a way, but this time it's healthy because they're not even made out of potatoes. And and these crisps, guys, are actually made by vegetables. And as you've seen by the title on the thumbnail, I'm going to be trying some off the eaten path pea and bean sticks. So and these are made, of course, with real vegetables, guys. And, yeah, I'm definitely going to be looking forward to trying these. And they're sea salt flavoured as well. So, yeah, I'm definitely very fascinated by this. Yeah, I've never tried, you know, a snack which is made out of peas before. And I love peas as, as like, a nice vegetable to have, you know, with, with dinner, you know, like roast dinner or whatever. Or just, like, dinners in general, really. So, let's see what I think of these. So, okay. So, it says here uh, on the back. So, there's, like, some facts here which I'll, I'll read out. It says it's made with real vegetables. It's got a source of fibre, not artificial colours, flavours or preservatives, suitable vegetarians, and 30% less fat, I guess, than crisp, I think, which is uh, pretty cool. And, yeah, I'm going to give it a try. Yeah, I like how, how it's, like, not really, like, a crisp bag. It's, like, you know, um, some sort of, like, you know, cardboard box sort of thing, really. Yeah, it's pretty cool, that. And here's the nutritional information, which I'm going to read. So, so the bag weighs 100 grams net weight, guys. So, so in this... So in this package, there is 1,850 kilojoules. Yeah, there's like a plastic bag in here, you can see here, see? Yeah, 1,850 kilojoules of energy, which is 441 calories. 17 grams of fat, of which 1.8 grams is saturated. 58 grams of carbohydrates, of which 2 grams is sugar. Wow. 8 grams of fiber, 9.7 grams of protein, and 2 grams of salt. So, so and this... This also contains uh, three to four servings, guys, depending on how many you, you want to have. So, yeah, um, let's uh, make a start, shall we, on uh, trying this. So, let's get it open at the top here. It's like, you know, um, sellotape thing, which is like, you know, secured it. Let's get it off. There we go. So, this is what it looks like when you, when you get it out. So, um, so, here are the sticks, guys. And as you can see, they're all different colours, really. Don't know if you guys can tell or not. Some of them, you know, appear to be like, you know, like white or yellow. One of them looks like it's a bit brownish and the other's green. So I, I can guess the green ones are the pea ones, which are made out of pea. So, so I'm definitely very keen to um, give these a try now. Absolutely. So, so yeah. So it says here it's a mix of pinto beans, green peas and white bean potato sticks, which is pretty interesting. So, yeah, I think the brown ones might be pinto and, and white bean will be the ones with like the white ones. So, yeah, green pea with the green ones. Yeah, it's like colour coding, isn't it? So let's get, let's get the bag open, shall we? There we go. Now let's um, do a smell test first. So already, guys, I'm getting like the smell of like, you know, um, kind of be like lentils in a way, really. Yeah, it's quite, quite similar to lentils, actually. So I'm going to try them one by one per type. So here's a green one, guys. One that looks like it's brown and also um, a white one. So so let's um, give it a try now, guys. So I'll start with um, the one which is green, is green first. So, so this is my verdict thumb. If I don't like um, the green one, thumbs down. Whereas if I do like it, thumbs up. So yes, let's give it a try, shall we? Mmm. Wow. Mmm. That is very good, yeah. When I'm back to into it, I can't really taste the pea, really. It tastes more salty than, like, pea, really. Mmm. That was really good. Okay, let's try this uh, brown one. This one might be pinto, I think. So, yeah, same rules apply with, with you know, thumbs up or thumbs down. So, let's give it a go. Again, mmm, very nice. There's a different taste to this compared to the pea a little bit, really, but it's still really nice. It reminds me a lot of lentils, this taste I've, I've, I've just experienced here with this one, but it's pretty good. And now for this one, things is, is the white bean potato one, so same rules again, guys, so let's give it a try, shall we? Mmm, wow. Again, that is really good. Delicious. Mm. 
yeah, in these, there's a very nice taste of salt, guys. So there's plenty of sea salt flavor there. You, you can barely even taste, you know, like, you know, the pinto or white bean or green pea in them at all, really. The only thing I could say is that there's a hint of like a lentil sort of taste in these, which I, I, I had. So, yeah, but nonetheless, well, these are definitely very nice. Mm. So, yeah, this is good. Really good. Mm. But, yeah, this was definitely very delicious. And next time I see these at my store, guys, I'm definitely going to get them again. You know, I saw them at my store and I was thinking, you know, hmm, this looks really nice. I'll, I'll, I'll give it a try, shall we? Why not say? And they're healthy as well, yeah. I was definitely amazed by how much sugar's in this. It's only two grams in two point two grams in this serving, which is pretty amazing. One hundred grams, so yeah. So there you have it, guys. I do indeed like the the off the Eaton Path pea and bean sticks, which are sea salt flavored. These are very nice. Um, so I do like them. So you know, drill guys, be sure to give this video a like. Also, be sure to comment what what you guys think of these if you ever have them. If you not have them and you want to try them, I'd recommend checking out your store, seeing if they're there or not. Or you could order on online supermarkets, whatever you use to get food with. Also, be sure to join Team Prime by pressing subscribe for more in the future. If you'd like to be a member, you can press join if you're using PC or lots, or you can in the description. And I'll see you all later.